Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with that man, Pink Diamond LeBron James, the most hyped card in NBA 2K25, my team, thus far this year. Now, he is exceedingly rare. Um, yes, he's in packs only. Yes, he is auctionable, um, but there are not very many on the auction house, and he is not cheap. So, my boy Daniel got super duper lucky and pulled Pink Diamond LeBron. As y'all can see, the rest of his squad isn't nothing crazy at this point. So pulling LeBron was a nuts pull for him. Congratulations to him. Really appreciate him letting me use his account to record this gameplay. Before we hop into it, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 30,000 subscriber mark on the channel. I upload every single day. Tons of consistent daily My Team content. Would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe. And I'm excited to try out this big Bron because he's going to be one of the very best cards in all of My Team. If not, arguably the best. We're going to have to wait and see. With that being said, big Bron, 6 foot 9 at small forward, 99 on offense and 98 defense, 97 driving layup, 89 mid range, 89 three ball 97 driving dunk day one that is nuts 87 ball handle 90 pass accuracy versatile elite defender as well 90 perimeter and interior i mean he is he's just insane 95 speed 91 speed ball 93 agility 94 vert 85 hustle 90 strength again this is a six foot nine on day one half posterizer dimer physical finisher on ball menace which is one of the best badges in the game 18 golds include badges like dead eye unpluckable interceptor pogo stick rebound chaser removable enforcer uh set shot specialist even paint patroller which replaces anchor that's a great badge lightning launch uh silver limitless handles for days challenger pick dodger glove i mean he does everything he's an elite card on both ends of the court can shoot the ball at a high level exceptional slasher of course and one of the very best defensive cards in the game there is nothing that lebron is not going to do at an absolutely elite level uh and i'm really excited to try the card out so we're gonna see what this big Bron is looking like in this game so king james let's change this camera also got to make sure that i got controller settings proper here um let's turn all this stuff off i gotta make sure that i have this set to how i would like it um for the shooting and we'll put that on set point and there you go let's see what big Bron's looking like so i keep saying big Bron. i apologize um i can't turn my meter off ah, I'll, I'll turn my meter off after freestyle it's fine um either way Bron. i mean sigs wise he does have his drag back which is absolutely absolutely elite dribble style does not look great i'll be totally honest um i don't think as a whole movement in this game is something that anybody's really figured out yet but lebron's drag back is absolutely exceptional definitely creates a lot of space with his step back animation um his escape looks okay behind the back doesn't do much dribble style looks really slow so um definitely not probably going to be running out of too many dribble moves with lebron push cross might be your better way to go when it comes to his movement because his dribble style is even by 2k25 standards really slow now jump shot I think it's really nice, honestly. I think it's better this year than it's been the last couple of years for LeBron. Uh, just a smoother, quicker release, and I think it's very, very solid, especially considering he does actually have pretty darn good shooting badges, especially for a day one Bron. It's going to be pretty butter, pretty chick. I mean, y'all are seeing I'm greening with a ton of consistency. Hopefully, I can green close to this consistently online because he looks really nice. This is going to be one of the best cards in the game, without a shadow of a doubt. Um, unstoppable in this rim-running, mashing meta for sure, but also able to stretch the floor um, and obviously one of the best defensive cards cards in the game at the small forward position there's quite obviously nobody better than lebron in my team he is one of the best cards in the game if not the best and i am super excited to use him so let's hop into a game see what lebron james can do all right so hopping into this showdown game we're going up against a dude with five wins who has a pretty good team i mean he's got amethyst anthony davis is it center excuse me he's got Rajah bell and ml car so two elite diamond wings who are going to give me some fits i think defensively also has derrick rose and then has um kevin durant at the four so this is not what i would consider an easy matchup by any means but king braun downhill gets stripped by d was that oh that was Rajah bell still getting stripped first play that's that's not how you want to start off a game by any means um it's going to be a tougher matchup that i was hoping for i'll be completely honest matched up against ml car who literally might be the best defensive card in the game on the perimeter period right now this is not what i would consider at all an easy matchup but we're going to drive the ball downhill hit braun catch and shoot and i have my meter on still i didn't mean to have my meter on i guess we're doing this gameplay with the meter on i forgot to turn it off whoopsie daisy uh that's not a great shot if he hits that more credit to him but uh let's run the floor swing it up to jaw morant jaw in the corner to braun he catches and calls for a pick and roll and we're gonna see if we can get downhill a little bit don't really got to do too much dribbling with braun i don't think it's i don't think that's the most effective way to go but kicking it out to kd for the pick and pop three braun's an elite passer hoff dimer is a very nice badge to have especially with how difficult shooting seems to be right now 
right now. Look at Braun defensively stripping ML Carr and playing D as well. He is showing off what he can do already. Anthony Davis coming in. The Lakers duo are making things happen so far. Can we get ML Carr to just touch the screen just a little bit? Hop, step through. Back out to AD. I don't know if I should. I feel like that. ML Carr is a god defensively, bro. That card is, you can just tell he is him defensively for sure. And that goes in. Cool. Nice way to start this game for sure. Um, we're going back to a pick and roll. See if I can force a switch basically. Because if I could get LeBron switched onto Derrick Rose, that's much more like it. Is this dude really going to sit off of AD all game? Because that's going to be really frustrating, I think. Because I'm not sure how confident I feel in my ability to shoot with AD. But Bron going downhill finishes at the rim. And Bron with his first bucket of the game finally. Ooh, that could have easily been a steal as well. But unfortunately, not going to be. And KD is somehow just blowing right by and getting to the rim. Not playing much defense so far, I'll tell you all that. Um, unfortunately, his CPU off ball seems to be giving me a couple of fits so far. So we force a switch here. Um, KD is kind of open, but actually we're just going to go back to this pick and roll. And if he makes the show, if, he, if I have to shoot with John Morant, I'll shoot with John Morant. That's a good look and a good shot. And I just have to hit, bro. I mean, I'm just plain and simple, not hitting shots so far. Kick to the corner, Vince for three. And I can't hit anything. And on high risk reward, I'm not going to be hitting, making shots if I'm not hitting them. That's... That's a frustrating spot. Start to this game. I'm not going to lie. He's wide open with D Rose and he misses right back. So I'm not the only one missing shots, but it is kind of annoying that I can't seem to hit a shot right now. Um, size up, attack downhill. Braun, see if we can get to the rim. Braun, hop step through. I didn't even want to go up with that. That's a freaking pump fake. Whew. Rough start to the game. I'm not even going to lie. Good defense, AD. Thank you for getting the board. We are struggling just a bit, though. I'll be totally honest. Come set me a good screen, please. Let's see if we can get our offense unlocked a little bit. Um, he's probably just going to help way off AD again. I'll take my slip. I'll take my dunk. King Braun with the slam, and he's up to four points, one rebound, one assist. Yes, it's a slow start. That's okay. Look at Bron with the block. Oh, my goodness. LeBron James just swatted Rajah Bell or ML. I don't know if that was ML Carr or Rajah Bell. I think that might have been ML Carr. Either way, that was a nasty block. That was a big play by LeBron James. Do I have auto subs on? What in the world are my boy Daniel? I appreciate him for letting me use his account for this gameplay. But what are your settings, bro? Like legitimately, I'm seeing auto subs and everything. I don't know. That's not what I'm looking for by any means. I don't love that pass, to be honest. Bron, back it up. Let's just shoot over the top. Bron for three. Oh, my gosh. He's wide open and he greens. Let's go. Showing off that silver limitless range. LeBron James is showing out to start this game. I want my starters in the game. I don't want them messing with my settings like this. Please don't do that. That's not nice. Uh, catch Braun again inside. Braun, go up and finish again just through contact. He's starting to get it going, man. Nine points, one rebound, one assist. It's been a struggle of the first quarter, and yet Braun's still putting on a solid performance. Love to see that to start the game off. Contest KD, play the fade. Good defense. That's not going in, and even if it did, it wouldn't count. Super solid first quarter. I'm not mad. Look at Braun switched onto a big. I bet he can guard AD. He can guard AD. Oh, my goodness. This card's tough. He is so good, bro. Look at the defensive switch ability, bro. That is just nasty that he is capable of that at this point in the year. Slightly early on, I have not shot with a three with AD all year. But that was – I felt like I held that down for quite a while. For that to still be a slightly early feels – a little, I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel about that, to be completely honest. Uh, I don't hate the pass, though, so I'll live with the result, even if it isn't a make, unfortunately. Catch here again. Somebody's open. It's John Morant. Drive the ball here. Back up to Braun. Let's get a pick and roll here with somebody. And Braun going baseline all the way to the rim. LeBron James gets stripped again? That's our ball, but damn. we're. I mean, I... The offense in this game is just rough. It is, man. I mean, it's just plain and simple. Uh, that's, that's the truth. The offense is, it's a struggle right now. I'm not even going to lie. Catch, shoot, jaw for three. That's a butter release, and jaw hits the three ball. We'll take our assists if he's going to focus big time on Braun, which seems to be the case so far. Uh, and we do have a 15-8 lead, so I am not mad with the way this game is going. Uh, would really love it if he would test Braun and let me, ooh, let me get a steal here or something. Okay, never mind. Did not mean to click on events there, and I just give a wide open dunk. We still have a five point lead though, so it certainly could be a whole heck of a lot worse. Um, gonna see if we can create a switch or something like that here. Attack downhill here, get a switch. We do have the switch we're looking for, and now we can space the floor and drive the ball. And bro oh my gosh, dude, Raja Bell and ML Carr are like that man defensively, bro. They are just making plays. Good quick slip though, Braun and one. Let's go, LeBron James with the and one dunk, and we get a rage quit. Super solid performance from Braun Braun. Let's do one quick triple threat park game and we'll finish out the gameplay.
All right, so I lied. I'm not sitting in Triple Threat Park waiting 10 minutes for a gameplay right now. I think we got enough gameplay in this video of Braun already in that first half. So, um, very good card. Yes, I did not play. I wouldn't say exceedingly well in this gameplay, but overall, learning the game, I gotta say, I don't love the gameplay. I talked about that earlier today, but... This Braun is incredible. He fits the meta of the game with the mashing and rim running for sure. Defensively, he is truly top tier. His size is elite. He's switchable. He's versatile. He can rebound. The Hoff Dimer is really nice as a passer. Overall, this is probably the best card in the game. Definitely one of the best, if not the best. And um, while the majority of people will not get this card, and he is obviously very expensive, he is also very, very good. So, hope y'all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back on more 2K content very, very soon. I appreciate y'all. Peace.